Video visits allow you to interact with your healthcare provider through live video and audio on your own device. You will be able to talk to your provider, similar to an office visit, by using your smartphone, tablet, or computer to connect through MyChart. To prepare for your video visit, you will need an active MyChart account, a smartphone, tablet, or computer, and a headset or earphones if available. It makes it easier to hear your provider and may improve the audio quality. For the best experience, you can download the free MyChart mobile app from the App Store or Google Play. You must use the MyChart mobile app to join a video visit on your smartphone or tablet. You cannot go to the mychart.mdanderson.org website from your smartphone or tablet and start your video visit. You will also need to download the Zoom Cloud Meetings app to the same device. If you need assistance, call Ask MD Anderson at 1-877-632-6789. You can use a computer to access your MyChart account at mychart.mdanderson.org. You may have more technical problems using a desktop computer or laptop instead of the MyChart app on a smartphone or tablet. In order to join a video visit from your computer, you will need to download Zoom Client for Meetings. You can check your webcam, audio output, and microphone under your computer's settings before the video visit. All of these features should be working if you recently use them for other video chats or meetings. To ensure your privacy, video visits are encrypted and not recorded. Using Zoom from inside my chart is different than using it for a regular meeting. There is an added layer of security since you are launching Zoom from within MyChart Secure Patient Portal. Each video visit uses a unique meeting number. This greatly reduces the ability for someone else to access your visit. Follow these steps to connect to your video visit. You can complete the e-update process up to seven days before your visit. It is helpful to make sure your video, audio, and internet connection are working correctly at least one hour before your video visit. Try using your headset or earphones too. Remember to keep your mobile device plugged in or fully charged and seek a strong signal or Wi-Fi connection. Plan to log in 30 minutes before your scheduled appointment time to start your video visit. First, Log in to your MyChart account. Click Appointments in the app or access the Visits tab if you are using a computer. Locate the Video Visit follow-up and then select E-Update. Next, click Review and Sign to complete the telemedicine consent. Click Next to review all sections. You will be asked to review and confirm your insurance, medications, and patient rights. Be sure to enter a phone number where you can be reached during your video visit. Your provider will use this number to call you if the visit is disconnected. If you complete the e-update process several days before your visit, you can log out of My Chart at this point. On the day of your appointment, log in to My Chart 30 minutes before your video visit begins. Click Appointments in the app or select the Details button if using a computer. Click the green camera icon to access your visit. Note, the green camera icon will not display until 30 minutes before your scheduled appointment time. Then, select the Begin Visit button to connect to your video visit. Click Open when asked to open this page using the Zoom application. Now that you are connected, you are in a virtual waiting room. Your provider will join you soon. When the provider connects to the visit, Zoom will ask permission to access your camera. Click OK. Click the Join with Video button. You can decline the request to receive Zoom notifications. They are not required for the video visit. 
Zoom will then ask permission to access your microphone. Click OK. You can now select your audio preference. Select Call Using Internet Audio to use Wi-Fi or data on your phone. You may also choose to dial in separately or have the app call your phone. After you make your selection, the video visit will begin. At the end of your visit, your provider will log off and the appointment is complete. You can click OK to leave the meeting. You will receive an after-visit summary in your MyChart account. If the connection is lost during your visit, but you can still see your video, the provider may be able to rejoin soon. Keep the video connection active and do not close the video window. If you lose your connection, restart the video visit following previous steps. You may be placed in the virtual waiting room until the provider is able to restart the video visit. If the video visit cannot be restarted, your provider will call you to complete the visit or provide further instructions. Be sure to be near the phone that you listed in the e-update.